Oh, hold on. Time to go live. Yeah, it is. And I'm live! Welcome, everyone, to the stream. Hello. I'm learning how to use the purifier! So any corrupted uh, wood or soil um, or leaves and you put that in there with any type of regular stuff pink agate wood glitter grass pink agate leaves any of those pink things and it no that become that becomes that and goldstone residue so we oh. need the goldstone residue okay there and then there's also aura residue wait what which is what you get in bismuth residue. Huh. What do you do with aura residue? Make it into aura clusters. Yeah. Ah, which is a block of aura crystal, which is really cool looking. And that comes from pyrite. Okay, let's do a little bit of that. Um, so he's gone. Oh, no. So throw that in here. Now... It is time. Oh, time to get some music going in the world. Time to find the last gemstone, which is the blue opal. Um, there are endermen everywhere. There are. I know. I can't figure out why. Probably in the blue area. So I'm gonna head east. I'm almost out of rockets. Do I have more rockets? I do. Okay, I'm good. So we've got um, quite blah, 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 gotten. We have progressed quite far. <laughs> there we go. Mm -hmm. um, we've got a lot of the things either done or almost done. So that's good. So we got to uh, find a few more. Oh, I gotta find the blue stuff first. That's that's the important it's stuff. Blue stuff and a biome, I believe. Yes, and more yeah. on biome duty. Okay. And once we get the biome, we'll have everything we need. And one of the cats light. has come through here. For that, and then once I get the blue opal, we can change that in the the other. Um, gem, which we can then make the last tools. All right, I need to find a lot of enemies that way. <laughs> A big old lava lake somewhere ahead of me. What is that, Sugalite? Meow. Am I above it? Ah, I'm above it. Okay. Oh, more of you guys. Nice. Ow! Rude. Go away. All right, white opal. We don't need that. We need blue opal. That's the important thing. Is this the one that I was at before? Because it looks similar. Torches around them. What is that thing? Blue opal. Blue opal. I'm dead. I have. Wow. Yay! And 15 is plenty, so time to head back to the top. Now we have to transform those opals into. 
the other thing. As soon as this one's done. Does the Gaia have a um a wiki? No. It's frustrating. It Banana person! Long time no see! You were away for us a long time. I do remember you. How have you been? Hope you've been well. Great to see you again. Okay, no. If I craft... Where's the crafting people? Oh, sorry, it's the purple one. An aura cluster. And a business crystal. Now what am I looking at here? 20 out of 22. We're getting closer. Um... If any of you guys are in the Gaia and you guys come across a bomb called the Volcanic Lands, let me know. That's the one I'm missing. Oh, okay. Mm, no, I'm in the smoldering bog. Ah. Uh, <laughs> that's fair. Sounds like you made poor life choices. <laughs> <laughs> no offense intended. Ah. Uh, what have you been up to, banana person? Huh? What's life been treating you like? Why am I have protection when leather boots on me? Go away, leather boots. Nobody likes. Oh, you. wait, 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 what? What? Wait. Yeah, Again! you did it! Woo! Woo! Yeah! Yay! I don't All know right. why I'm so happy about this. No, I'm, I'm excited. Uh, while you're out, though, find, see if you can find some of the corrupted uh, wood. <laughs> Dude. Do you. I've been through so many of those corrupted biomes. Give me, I think there's one like right next to me. Logs are fine. Ooh, the stripped ones are really pretty. I think this is corrupted. This is static waste. All right. Ow. Oops. Am I at 20? 20, 21 Ow. out of 22. I'm missing one still. Hmm. Um, was, there, was there corrupted stuff in the Firelands? Sounds reasonable. I think I, no, because this is the. Sorry, I'm just trying to piece together it would be. Oh, we need to do the gold stone. That'll be the last one. And then we'll have that one too. Yes! Woohoo! Oh, yeah, I think there's actually in the Goldstone Islands. Give just me it's cool. Oh, I get that, banana person. I get that. I was young once a young lad myself. Going through all the the learning and the curriculums and such. Oh, long gone are those days though. All right, so, man, I think, holy crap, we might be done pretty soon then. Oh, wow. Poor T. He just got in the dimension. We're almost done. Well, should we start discussing the next one, or do we have that one already? I do not have a next one, so we should probably start discussing that at some point. Fair enough. Look at T putting down portals because he's smart. What do you mean putting down portals? A portal next, or not a portal? Did I say portal? I didn't mean a portal. A waystone? I said waystone. That's what I said. You heard me. You misheard me. Mm. What are you trying to do now? We're trying to complete the dimension, and uh, this is the Gaia dimension. We've been playing it for well, we played it fully last week, and then the week before that, we started on it. Um, just got you know into it and got the got the um, the portal ready and everything, um, and then this week we're supposed to be. What are those things? Oh, I remember those guys. Um, this week we're supposed to be doing more with them, but looks like we're almost done. All right, you guys find that I'm going to go looking for another green tower because we have one more piece of armor to get from the, uh, the, the dude at the top. Also, uh, I don't think they just spawned in the green biomes because uh, I flew over one in a pink biome a while ago. I don't know if we had already been to it or not. Really? Interesting. It was very brief. I'll see if I can waypoint it for you if you'd like. 
How far away is it? I imagine fairly far. Well, I'm going to explore... Oops, that's not the right button. I'm going to explore this green biome, and then if I haven't found anything, I'll ask you for the coordinates. Aye, aye. You know, we haven't updated this mod since it since we installed it on here. I don't know why it's doing this weird chunk border issue. Oh, I found one. Oh, wow. It might be a new one. It might not be. It's a new one. Okay. Yay. Will it give me the thing that I want? If I stop hitting these guys with my bow and actually swing my sword at them, maybe. I love this pose. He's all like, hey -ya! <laughs> hey -ya! Oh, hi, T. I think I found the corrupted. Here. Uh, goldstone corrupted lock? Um, hold on, let me pull up the thing. Yes. Okay. Get, like, a, a bunch, because they look cool. I'm boots? just going to clear cut this entire forest. Oh, those are mine. He stole them from me. I forgot about that. Yeah. Thank you, T. All right. Uh, let's go south. I, I... Now that you've you've got your um your thing working, I'm sure that goes a little bit quicker. Hmm. Uh... I forgot I can vein mine. <laughs> I'm not laughing at you, really, I'm not. <laughs> I'm laughing at myself. <laughs> no, I don't think I can, though, because it's still technically wood. Oh, you still can vein mine wood. <gasps> uh huh. Just blew you your mind. Vein mine wood. I'm very happy. Thank you. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> Wrong tower. I am not the bright, I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed. Well, in your defense, wood does not usually come in veins, so it is contrary to the name. But um, I don't know if this is okay. actually vein mining that we're doing as a mod. It's, it might be. Well, if it's ore excavator, that's even harder stretch to. Yeah. Apply. What are you? I'm a human being. Not you. There's a red gremlin. Ow! Ow! Oh, you're rude. Oh, it's a growth spider. Ew. How are you? Does not sound pleasant. It's not. Nah. Oh, I found another infected. tower. I might die. Oh, okay. Forgive me for chuckling. It may happen. No, I'm good. Oh. Dude, I mean, that's good. That's what, yeah, that's more. That's more salty than you laughing. <laughs> don't you dare knock off what my pants! What I need you? my pants. Oh, jeez, what are you? Those are my like pants. You. Hey, I don't like give me you. my helmet back. Rude. You're creepy. What are you? Uh, there's a naga here apparently. Oh, you can't shoot him. Oh, that's nice to know. Oh yeah, and I thought I mentioned that last time. Oops. I didn't pay attention. Oh, I might die. Holy cow. Warning, if you ever get hit by a corrupted uh, mania it, or mana mania, it really hurts. Well, don't do that then. Where do you, well, where do you gee, go? golly gosh. Yeah, you're welcome. You probably wouldn't have known that if I hadn't told you. Oh. Yeah. Doing all the things. This is scarier than I thought it was going to be. What that, that that world? This this biome. I loved it when I first found it. Now so far I've had three things try and kill me within thirty seconds of mining trees. Oh, there's impure stuff here. Gotta be honest, it looks like a combination between compost and poop. Uh, I'm gonna try and get four stacks of the wood, but if there's another nog, I'm booking it. 
Ooh, yeah. Supper is important there, banana person. Enjoy your supper. I just got done with supper. We had enchilada, and they were delicious. I've had enchiladas in a long time. And nutritious. Um, well, to be I'd... fair, I didn't eat much because my stomach's been off. That's fair. Is it though? I didn't seem fair. Doesn't seem fair. No. But like, didn't. I'm trying to sympathize with you. Oh, and I apologize. See ya. Ow! The mania. How much are you getting? Because I feel like you've gotten in. Uh, I'm at two stacks and seventeen. Yeah, that's plenty. That's plenty. You said I get a lot. And... That's plenty. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go to the Nether. Get more gold. I have gold. a warp stone. Why am I flying? That's a really great question. Don't do anything till I get back, though. Huh? Don't do anything till I get back. Hold on, I'm gonna make a beacon here. This is a. To actually find my way back here. Cause I, I left because I want to go get some more gold because we're running low on gold again. Tiffin is sleeping. Tiffin has stopped sleeping. Where's the gold? Where's the gold? Where's the gold? There's gold. To a local bakery today with my little brother. Cool. It's did you get anything? I did. I got two Valentine's Day cookies and a hot chocolate. Nice. Um my wife just got some hot chocolate that she ordered because it was a good deal on Amazon. Only it's not hot chocolate, it's um hot salted uh, caramel. Hmm. Like like hot chocolate only, you know. Not chocolate? More delicious. -er. Fair enough. I'm not a caramel person, honestly. <gasps> I don't like I don't know. I'm not I don't mind it. Mm. And there's like I don't mind Werther's, but like uh, mo oh, I don't like Werther's. No, that was I, like I love Werther's. I love Werther's. You but, said like, you don't mind them and now you, you say you love them. What which one is it? <laughs> I <laughs> Pick a I, bridge I, to I, die on here. No, I don't want to die. Hmm. So therefore, I'll not be picking. Hmm. It's hmm. called beating the system. <laughs> nah, 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 gotta pick a bridge. Nope. The bridge will be picked for you. No, fine, I picked my bridge. I'm making my own little tiny bridge with like a few pieces of wood. And, and it's gonna break and you're gonna die on it. And gorilla glue. And that that's my bridge. Mm. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> T weighs in on the subject. <laughs> he speaks. Dang it. What you didn't mean to speak? <laughs> I meant to have been a few more pieces of glass. That's what I meant to do. Aha. Uh, cool. Okay. Hi, Skunk. Hi. What do you need me to do? Okay, so first off, I'm going to put this stuff in here. All right. I don't know why I'm going crafting it. How many things have you crafted? Not very many. I've crafted three. 
Did I craft armor? Crud. You crafted I've, tools, though. I, no, I've crafted I'm, armor. Okay, That's well... That's what I've been crafting. I haven't, I've only done three tools, though. Oh. Okay, so in this chest that I'm got open here, there's enough carnelian and diopside to make the armor. Okay. And then the carnelian and the uclase and the ixiolite and the benetoite oh. needs the tools. Okay. Um, I need your your wood though. It's in front of the crafting table. Oh, it's so pretty. Did you did you strip it? I did not. Oh, where's my axe? Need... Oh, I love that. Uh huh. Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? That's pretty. Okay, so if we impure rock, oh, yeah. huh? Well, I can put that in there, too. Wait, so if this is the line. top, I Here's don't need any of that. Car carnelian armor. All right. You can you put that on the... I'm wearing it. Oh, you're wearing it. Fancy smancy. I'm being quirky. All right. Um. So purifier, you put that in the top. You take the impure stone out because impure has nothing to do with purity. No, apparently not. <laughs> Very confusing. Uh, five of those oh. I need. Okay, so after you um, craft that, if you don't get the, the thing, then pick up all the rest of the armor off the thing and hopefully it'll count. Ooh, that's fancy green. Yeah, this is like a bit nicer. Is that? Oh, that's your shirt showing through. I was like, what are the red spots on it? Yeah, that's my shirt. It's my flannel. I'm sorry. Turn, 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 turn. Being Canadian. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, I sorry. The, eh? I saw the funniest thing. Um, there's a there's a guy that I uh, watch on YouTube called Let's Game It Out, and he gets like preview versions of games. Uh, the developers give him codes to it. Yeah! Woo! Go, my man! I did it! Look at you getting all the purples. Oh, I did get the inservitude one. Um, and ow, ow, I'm on fire! Oh no! Yeah, you're. <laughs> yeah, you got your, your things. Your armor doesn't matter for that. Um, that was unnecessary panic. <laughs> he played a game this last week. I don't remember what it was, but. The developer says that they're based in East Canada. Ooh. And they've got a lot of uh they the the it's all in French. And oh, the funny back? thing is, um there there's four different like stats you have to take care of. There's like, you know, energy and tiredness, and then there's maple syrup. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's just the awesomest. That is amazing. All right, so what other things need to be done? Okay, so now in the chest there are benetoite, uh, ixiolite, uclase, and carnelian that all need to be made into tools. Okay, I'm gonna steal the sticks. Yeah, the sticks are there for you to do that. Okay. Um. Anyone have any idea how to use a purifier here? Because all I'm seeing is that you put in the, the, the corrupted tile slab. Tile? Kyle? Or anything. Kyle? I said tile. Oh, you said okay. Kyle. I said tile. Corrupted tile. You said you said Kyle. <laughs> tile. Rewind that, know? please, people. <laughs> I'm the. I'm just saying. I heard Kyle. I don't know who Kyle is, or if and if, and if uh, there, this guy's important. I don't. Re don't let him replace me. Ooh, I like the strip version. Let's, let's get some of that going here. Where would you get that axe? Which axe? I don't care. Just get an axe over here and strip these. Huh? 
Sorry. Thought you wanted me to make this stuff. Well, that too. I think mine's <gasps> my inner chest. Oh. <laughs> I'm one stick too short. Hold up. Um. And then you took all my stuff. Thanks. Thanks. Appreciate it. Is... Oh, T, took it. Never mind. We're one thing away from being done, it seems. And I'm one stick away from being done. Hey, I'll be right pink back. Agate. No, no, come here. There's pink oh. tiles here. I got it. That's why they're in the chest there, too. I didn't see them. Sorry. Yeah, it's right there. That's odd. Okay. So I couldn't get through the portal. I can put the pink stuff in there. Can I put them anywhere else? No, I can't. What else could we possibly put in there? What I feel like I might have to join their Discord just to figure it out. Hold up. Uh, I'm missing a lot of tools, so it's not working. Um, I'll, you should also pick up the Chalcedony ones and the Sugalite ones. I'm just everything. You also need to make the agate ones, which are with the the wood itself. Okay. What could you possibly need to put in here? They need to make this more user friendly. Mm-hmm. Do we need a cup? Is that a tool? Don't believe cups are tools unless you're unless you're playing baseball. What? <laughs> Wanna share with the class while you're giggling? <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> okay. Oh, I don't have the Ixley <sighs> God delete. The Ixiolite? Oh, okay. Thank you. I don't um, know why I had issues pronouncing that word. It's not an easy... Oh, I gave you the Ixiolite. You know, you did. I just forgot to craft it. Oh, okay. <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was on me. <laughs> okay, okay. What to put in here? I guess I'll just start grabbing everything and just try putting it in there. Do you have to make hoes? No, there are no hoes. Okay. Okay, none of that goes in. Uh, hold up. What? You aren't streaming Twitch? No, I don't stream Minecraft on Twitch, Jay. I stream other games on Twitch. I miss, I'm missing out only a few. I have 23 out of 28. All right. Um, try. It. Did you make the agate stuff? Yeah, you did. Yeah. Uh, the Sugalite. Do we have all four of those? Yeah. What is this? This is World of Dimensions, Jay. I play with uh, T Finn and Morbid. Hi. And I used to play with Steam, but he disappeared. Hence why um, I'm now Dollar Store Steam. <laughs> um, and then uh, it's the World Dimensions. We started off originally with playing Between Lands. And then we finished that, and we're like, what do we do now? So I just started adding dimensions to the world. And that was in 1.12. Now we're in 1.16. And we're starting off with brand new dimensions. And we conquered them little by little. So we've been to blue skies and to conquer them. We, we just finished all of the things. So uh, um, let's see where we tear it is. That was a shorter one. Right now we're on the Gaia dimension. Atlantis was really easy to conquer. Um, I, I don't was, know what you're talking about. I think that was like the hardest one he had to do. Yeah. No, yeah. Um, this is one that we haven't finished. The afterlight. Yeah, that one is not doable. We found that out. Um. So yeah, there's a bunch of different. Oh yeah, the undergarden. So we conquer them. Then we add more dimensions. So it's just the world of dimensions. Mm -hmm. Can I add impure stuff to it? No, I can't. Right now we're trying to use this. Restructure, not restructure, the purifier. We don't know. You should take out Advent of Ascensions. Yeah, we played Advent of Ascensions in season one. And gonna be brutally honest, I didn't like it. 
it just added too much. It felt like they were just throwing stuff at it, just to throw away at it. Um, maybe residue? Do we throw residue? We throw residue in there. Ooh, okay, okay. That's getting somewhere. Now what do I throw in the third one? Unfortunately, this one doesn't have a wiki. It doesn't have a lot of inf other information, so we're just kind of guessing at how to do some of these things. Fine thread. Nope, that ain't it. Um, just regular old cobblestone? No. We could try the pink essence. <gasps> pink essence! I did it! I figured it out! Yay! I brute forced my way through it. As it should be. I feel like I maybe have missed cropping. Oh, this, this is cool. I know you don't like the color, but I like that log. <laughs> what is it? The stripped pink agate log. Honestly, the way it looks is I don't mind it with the combination it is. The world is disappearing underneath our feet. Ah! Oh, I'm going to die. <laughs> There go thing we had. Sleep, sleep. Not like I had all the tools there. <laughs> it was worth it. So worth it. I am never agreeing with you ever again. <laughs> where's, where's my infinity bucket? Actually, Infinity Bucket might not be the smartest. It's just water. Mm, what? That didn't work. <laughs> you think? Don't you dare. Whoop! Yay! I'm using the infinity bucket! <laughs> Crunch munch. Indeed. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Joke's on you, it's in a slap. <laughs> mm, this slap. No. Oh. Why would you do this to me? Oh, now you're just watching me slowly fall to my knees. <laughs> oh, jeez! <laughs> Laugh at me. That was hilarious. <laughs> All right. Apparently, I had another grave down here I didn't know about. No, you just died twice. No, I had a third. Well, those are cool. Not your graves, but that block. Oh, my elytra are almost broken. That's cool. All the armors. Ow, you want to fill that hole in? <laughs> uh huh. See how it's going to be. Try to play nicely, but that's the way you're gonna treat me. Well, that is such gar- You attacked me first! There was no attacking. I simply mined some blocks. This is I Minecraft. Am... It's one of the things you do, is you mine blocks. Okay. Let's go. I'm- It looks like we're missing... a Sugalite shovel. Which is weird, because we should have had enough. Uh, 
question, Skunk. Mm. Do you have any Sugalite? Sure, we do. Right. Yeah, we got 12 in there. And 64 okay. blocks. And 55 blocks. Alright. Don't hurt me, please. Because I'm actually trying to be productive. <laughs> Don't you dare. Dude, what is your issue? I have no issues. Is that a safe spot? Stop it! Issues. <laughs> Did you make the shovel yet? I did a quick check. Did I, I didn't make a shovel, did I? Did I make a pickaxe? Yep. <laughs> Nicely done. Me no brain! Apparently <laughs> there's popcorn chicken on the stove. Mmm, that sounds mm. delicious. Okay, Chalcedony. There's a bunch of things here that we can't even get yet. Hopefully they'll be implemented soon. Okay, we're at 24 out of 28. I'm missing four tools. So, obviously, it's one thing. Okay, do we have Chalcedony? Uh, e wait. Hold up, wait. Yeah, that's the white ones. Yes. Okay, we have the Benetoite. We have the yes. Carnelian. The Euclase. The Iseolite. The Sugalite and the Agate. What do you mean? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven times four is 28, right? Seven times four? Yeah, but that's because I picked up everything in this chest. I organized it. Okay, pick it, it up like and put it in your, uh, like, in your hotbar thing. Because sometimes uh, it doesn't count unless you put it in your hotbar. It's really dumb. Hold up. I need to drop it. Yeah. Oh, I got your 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 arc. Let's see now. Oh, how considerate. Where? On the ground behind you. Never mind. It's in Where your did I hide those villagers? You're hiding villagers? Over here. Yes, they're right here. Oh dear, there are kids in here. That means it's still going. Yeah. Well, you, you, you remember it? that comment I made about uh, hoping the villager breeding stopped? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Not it hasn't quite. stopped yet. Ha. Huh. Uh, I think more would... What? What did <laughs> I do? Uh-huh. What I do? You must have come over here and given them more food, because the mm -hmm. random amount of food that I gave there them we go. must have been. Yay! Right Dude, I've literally been like in the Gaia and up here the entire time. Uh huh. Yeah. Well, it could have been yeah. any time in the last, you know, few weeks. I haven't actually been down to the villagers. So. Yeah, you also like, don't even know where they are. I don't. That's true as well. Likely story. Got it. What are we? We did it. Yeah, we did. Uh, what now? Uh, it's been half an hour. It's been half an hour. Beats. I need beats. Shortest stream ever. Beats. <laughs> Where are the beats? I think Dre has them. No, he sold Does them. Does he have a PhD? Is this Doctor Dre? <laughs> <laughs> Is Dr. Mario Wait. I think so. Sounds right. I, th I think. I would ask T. He's the he's the music aficionado of the group. Dude, what like, did that have like, to do with him? Is is he a real music guy? Like is he does he actually exist or is he just a meme? 
<laughs> I would really like to say that he doesn't exist. Ah. Uh, yeah, that kind of. But that kind of finishes that one. You know. I'm pretty sure you'll find evidence of his existence somewhere. Uh, look, I'm more into like sea shanties and stuff, so I don't know popular music. I don't need the beats, I need the seeds. Wait, not an actor? What about. What about. This isn't working. Yeah, I think. Nicely done. I had one job here. You kind of did. You kind of sucked at it. No offense. Them some beats. Them some beats. And you get a beat, and you get a beat, and I got a really you cool block, beat, Marvin. And you get a beat. Another beat for everybody all the way around. <gasps> it changes colors! Yep. I love everybody it. Got five beats, you get a six beat because you actually exist. <laughs> Thank you. All right, so that's the Gaia dimension. Um, <laughs> well, thanks for coming out to the stream, guys. <laughs> have Have you got an open um, mitt? An open mitt. Yeah. Hand. Mob imprisonment tool. Oh. Um. Hi. There you are. I do. Come over here. Okay. Here. Uh-huh. What am I doing? See this hole? I'm You'll in the grab hole. grab one of them. Anyone? Um, an adult one. Okay. I'm kidnapping someone. We're putting them in the farm. What farm? That doesn't sound illegal. <laughs> we're farming villagers. Okay. We're we're we're, t we're taking them over here, and we're putting which, them up on top farm? of the farm. Here, here, here. I can't carry it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not really sure how your ladders are working here. It does not look like they should. <laughs> um. So this one over here, fine. Yeah. And then I need one in the middle and one more there. Okay. Are any of them getting potatoes and carrots? No, 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 no. These these are the beets, guys. Oh, I mean, are the ones that do that, though? Oh, yeah, yeah. There's a potato level and a carrot level. Okay, good. And two wheat Because we need them for sandwiches. Yeah. Those baked potatoes are good for sandwiches. Gotta be honest, I've never actually had a baked Top, potato sandwich. And we got four guys around here. It seems side. like more of a Canadian thing to do. Probably. Guy. I'm not gonna deny that. <laughs> I've had mashed potatoes on sandwiches. Oh, yeah. On like, an on open buns. face one, yeah. No, on a burger. On a burger? I, oh, that's interesting. Um, I haven't had them on a burger. Burger King did that once. They had, like... Really? Burger. <laughs> yeah. That's not what I wanted. Apparently, it wasn't what anybody wanted. <laughs> Doesn't actually seem like it, no. <laughs> I went to Tim Hortons like the first time in like a long time today. How was it? Man, you're going all the places today. 
I was. Okay, so here's the thing. I was supposed to go to the bakery with my friend because I have, like, between my high school and my college classes, I have a weird hour. And so a friend and I were going to with we're gonna uh head to the bakery and get something to eat there and then head to class she bailed on me so that i had like a weird hour <laughs> i didn't know what to do and i was planning to eat at the bakery so i didn't bring any food with me i didn't want to go to the bakery alone so i ended up just going to the tim hortons drive through and eating in my car in the parking lot of the college yeah that's where i went to to jay where work twinsies i went to school I think stuff. <laughs> I think it goes like you're trying to fit in, but it just isn't quite working. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's like trying to put a square in the circle hole. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not working out. Alley round two tree. Guess who you I, saw today? Your boss. Your coworker. Your wife. Your reflection. Your... Mickey Mouse. Everyone you looked at. What? It's a miracle. Fine, I'll get out of bed. Oh. I'm in bed. Um, Dude. <laughs> bed. Now you're going um, to sleep. I see. Okay. I went in bed the one I saw. It just for some reason mm -hmm. like I was lagging or something. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess I don't need to sleep. Fine. Don't need me anymore. Genuine question. What now? I don't know. I'm making sandwiches. That's fair. Uh, we need to discuss what mod to do next. Dimension to do mm. next, I should say. That's true. I haven't made a garden for either the past two mods. I haven't... I have, like, gardens scattered around the entire Oops. world at this point. Um. What is this? Blue sky. Is, can we plant more of those? They probably planted somewhere. Oh, no. Blue skies was a recent one. Somebody just said that they didn't do the recent ones. Hmm? That's what I said. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> wow, lots of skeletons over there. All right. Those are getting done. I kind of want to make a rainbow garden with all the mods and stuff. But I don't know where to make it. Does anyone in chat have any suggestions? For the next mod? Mm -hmm. I've seen the B one a few times. I could Respectfully. Pop on <laughs> no, but I could hop on curse boards and see if there's any uh, dimension in those categories. We can do that. Um, the only restrictions, Jay, is that it has to be a different dimension than the overworld. So... We did play with Outer End and End Remastered because they changed the end. Um, and I don't think we did. Did we do anything with another? I don't remember if we did anything with another. I think just Court to the Nether. Um, so the different dimensions that we have are the Undergarden, Blue, Dimensional Dungeons, because obviously those are dimensions. Um, Teridus. This is the Gaia Dimension, Atlantis Dimension. Uh, the Afterlight. You're going to suggest Ender Master. Yep. Um, Twilight Forest. And yeah, that's about it. So it has to be a dimension. Um, 
And whether we, we prefer that it has more stuff to do like this or like this rather than this. Was was the rather than this the Atlantis dimension? Uh mm, probably was. No, no advent of ascension. We did that one last season. And like I said, I just felt like they were just adding stuff to add stuff. Advent was the one that had lots of different... Uh... Mm -hmm. But it felt like rinse and repeat of the same stuff over and over again. Alright. Um, I'm getting more food because sandwiches are important. Probably didn't see that. Yep. All right, so I wanted to look at blue skies to see if I get more of that pink cherry grass block. Okay. How about the one with the dark dimension? Well, that's although that's just a bunch of resource gathering. Um. Possibly. What does it look like? I don't. I don't know it. Uh, my curse ward is frozen. It's not uh -oh. frozen. I lied. Apparently. Okay. It, it right as I said that it started working again. Oh, the deep dark. Didn't we didn't do that? That's a that's a biome coming up. Um, yeah, the deep dark is just a, a yeah resource one. There's probably not any um. We call it um, advancements to get there. I don't need as many blocks as I just made. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah, probably is. That sounds right. Do, 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 Is that it? Um, There's a bunch of cats in this dimension. What dimension? Uh, the blue, um, blue skies one. Okay. Um, we did the Twilight Forest. Hey, Brace! Welcome to the stream! Mm. Yep, yep. No! Yep. Yes, Basement Prison Warden is here. No, they're not. Ah, I know. It is tea. You are 100% correct, Brace. What? What's tea? You're drinking tea. I hate tea. Uh -huh. I don't like tea either. Wow. Hot, cold, sweet, unsweet. It's all bad. I don't mind iced tea, but I think that's just because it's. I think you're it's talking different about the Canada. musician. No, the powder. <laughs> iced tea. Yeah, like the powder you get. Yes, like the powder that I got right here. Yeah. Nope, it's all bad. Well, iced tea doesn't like taste like tea though. Is the thing. Well, there's like I one tea I've had that's more like tea. tea. I don't. <laughs> tea never has. I'm tea never has enough flavor for me. It's like whatever oh, flavor gee, it is, someone thanks. stood in the room over and yelled it out. It's like, <laughs> um. Like, let's, for example, honey tea. It's like someone stood like three rooms over, just yelled, honey, and called it a day. But that's just my excuse. What do you do with those things? Uh... Oh, fun mail. <clears throat> Did we ever finish the um, dimensional dungeons? Um, you are welcome to keep going with it. 
Oh, I don't want to. I'm just asking. <laughs> What's this? Hold up. I think. Oh, well, never mind. Can't this pick is either of those up. That's sad. I found um... something called Abyssal Craft. But it's 1.12. Yeah. So I'm just going to. RF Tools Dimension? Part. They have a dimension? RF Tools has a dimension generating system. Oh, interesting. It basically makes like random dimensions that you go into and get more stuff out of. So that eventually you can refine your dimension generating ability. Oh, jeez. I, I found a mod, but it's like really big. How big is it really big? Um, four mini bosses, eight armor sets, three dimensions. Oh, three uh, dimensions. Mana system, magical items, and dangerous creatures. Mana system. Ooh, I like that sound. Uh, it's called the Abyss. I'm just reading like the poster it has. Uh, a long time ago, the Abyss was a lush and vibrant place full of beautiful beings and creatures. The realm was one of was one of light and magic. I thought that said mayo for a second. <laughs> <laughs> We've got mayo <laughs> magic until the night blade came into existence and command and commanded his phantoms to devour the light and beauty. The abyss is now a tortured realm that exists between space and time. A world parallel to the overworld is now up to it is now to you, the player, to save the overworld from the now spreading abyss, which seeks to devour the realms. The Abyss adds a brand new dimension to explore, full of unique adventures and dangers. It's a dimension of darkness, the only light coming from magical blocks and various flora, fungi, and fauna of the dimension. The Abyss is also a magic mod, which adds various magical items, artifacts, and magical rings. There are almost 25 different spells and more than 4 mini-bosses and over 8 sets of over 8 armor and tool sets. You can make over 25 different magic rings. Every single one is magical and unique, but be sure the stronger you become, the more the abgrunt. I'm not gonna try and pronounce that word. Will haunt you. Haunt you. Um. I was are gonna you try to, to look step? where you were looking to see, but you're just staring at a chest. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm I'm, I'm on a uh, curse yeah. forge on the line. <laughs> Uh, are you ready to step into the on the other side, or will you die? It's up to you now. Well, more of it. We know that for sure. Oh, absolutely, I will die. I mean, oh, I was gonna say I haven't died this time, but I did. I didn't die last time. Um, just um, true. Uh, the aether is a no go because we did that in one point twelve. Now, if we run out of ones, I would entertain the idea of adding it just to see the updated oh, bits. I need that. Um. Do you want me to send you a link to this one, Skunk? Because this one actually looks kind of cool. It just looks like a fairly large mod. Is I can add shaders right now. Um, put it in the the, the Discord. Okay. Oh wait, that's um, your front. That that's your back. So you weren't staring it's called at the chest. Chapter two, though, is the thing. So I don't know if there's like a prior one that's needed or. Can I not do? Yes, if you want to not do. Oh, yeah, we don't have Optifine here, so I don't have shaders. No. Ratlantis? Mm. Didn't we do Atlantis already? No, Ratlantis. Oh, Ratlantis. I heard Atlantis. Yeah, they've got pirates there. Pi Again, I don't know if you're saying pirates or pirates. That's right, pirates exactly. And further, if it's pie rats, is it like pirate rats? Rat? Is it like pi rats that are in pies, or is it like pirates that are rats? It's <laughs> a little rat rats. wearing a pirate hat. Oh! <laughs> really? I'm sorry. Too cold I for shade. <laughs> I'm sorry. I I I I love rats. Rats are adorable. I want to talk. Yeah, about rats it. are underappreciated. They they actually make they a good pet. I couldn't They're convince my wife of that, but illegal in Alberta. That's an odd thing to make illegal, but okay. Well, I learned about it Alberta in my rats. It's because and there's of pirate ships, or, yes. or maybe the Norway rats. Or, you know. Jackal loves pirates. Yes. Yep. Lol. I love the pirates. Yep. You know, uh, we learned about it in my uh, comparative cultures class. Um, about Wait, are you saying that 
Alberta and uh, BC have different cultures? Uh, yeah, every province in Canada has different cultures from each other. You guys are weird. You guys are weird. I'm sorry, you're saying someone from Florida has the exact same culture as someone from Washington? Basically, yeah. <laughs> Don't T, as, a, as an American, can you confirm this information? <laughs> hey, I've lived in both places. Things are very different in different places, but also not. Yeah, that about sums it up. Yeah, that's right. I mean, like, just breaking it down, even just, like, between BC and uh, Quebec, there's just a totally different language. Well, French people are weird. You're weird. American people are weird. Yeah. Not as weird as the French, but yes, we are. I kind of want to go to Quebec one day. It looks really cool. And cold, but cool. Looks very cold. These First red I saw stones. when I lived in Japan. They go... We are the, one of the, the only places on the planet that does not have rats. Interesting. Who, who doesn't have rats? Okay, here's Jackal. the thing with uh, rats in Alberta. If you look at a map about where all rats are, Alberta is the one place in the world with the no form of rat. <laughs> it's like... It's like it, it, right next to like in Alberta or not Alberta, in like BC. I'm ninety percent sure in Saskatchewan or Saskatchewan. Um, not too sure about the territories. There's rats, a lot of them. They just know not to cross the border. Yeah, but yeah, no, that's the case. They just know that uh, there's no rats in Alberta, and the there rats are no know that. rats in America. No, wait, that's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know that it's illegal to hurt raccoons on Sundays in Virginia? Well, yeah, they don't want you hunting them. Sunday's Did the you day know, of rest. I, I don't remember where it is, but it's illegal to drag a dead horse down the street on a one, on a Sunday. I don't believe that. It's work. It's illegal to drive into the state of Wisconsin from Minnesota with a chicken on your head, too. But, you know. <laughs> I love weird laws. Because they're just so uh, respectfully dumb. I want to I wanna break it. I want to break that law. Let's do it. Like, uh, fun fact, in Canada, it's illegal to pretend to be a witch. So you either have to be one or just yeah, no, not. You can be one. The, just, there, there, is more con there, there is more context to that rule that makes sense. It's just funny. Just no, no, it doesn't. <laughs> there are. Uh, it's, you, the full rule law is that it's illegal to pretend to be a witch and make a profit from it. It's like you can't... Sell say you that you're a witch. Witchery. You can, yeah, you can't sell things under the guise that, of being a witch. Does that if you are, include like if you being are not a fortune wicked. teller? Uh, if you're claiming to be a witch, yes. If um, you're just claiming to be a fortune teller, it's I think a different story. I don't know. Fortune tellers kind of seem like witches to me. So, well, it depends on what you're looking at. Um, I have a friend who's Wiccan, and so technically speaking, she's a witch. As long as she doesn't pretend. <laughs> oh yeah, no, she does. As long as she doesn't like pretend, it's fine. But so and make actually... money from it. <laughs> Got it. Can't... Then the government's coming for you. <laughs> you can do one or the other, but you just can't do both at the same time. <laughs> these. It's not these, silly. Here. These two little wheat farms here can get out of the out of your way. The law. Oh, sorry. Here's a law that I am certain anyone who has owned any form of comic book has broken. It's illegal to publish, um, possess, or have possession of, illustrate, write, anything, a comic book with violence in it. With violence in it? Any form of violence or, or illegal activity. Uh, so there wow. goes DC's entire job in Marvel. Yeah. It's like it's kind of it's like a kind of funny kind of funny of a yeah. rule. Very. All right. I think the witch law though is in Canada only. We we carrot potato beef. <laughs> That's funny, Brace. He says it's illegal to call Arkansas Arkansas. Arkansas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Is that like? Oh, it's like the monkey has flower. 
I'm sorry, I saw the, the iron golem was offering a flower and it's adorable. You're adorable. Wait, no, that didn't come out right. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> reverse, reverse. <laughs> oh, that one's cooked. Oh, okay. Insult did not work as intended. <laughs> 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 that moment when you're trying to insult someone, but you accidentally compliment them. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, it could be insulting to call someone it could. adorable. If you're um, calling someone adorable just because they're short, then that's insulting. Oh, yeah, I don't, that's why I don't call my wife adorable. <laughs> are, you, are you calling somebody short? What? Move me? No, I'm totally not doing that. Hopefully, she's not listening. <laughs> <laughs> Is this blue skies? This is blue skies. Okay, good. I am slightly below the average height um, in my country or my area. So but you're like, like three foot six? What? Hobbitville? What? Oh. No, I'm five, like four, I think. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Sorry, you don't know what feet are. I get to use a quote that actually works. Oh, I well. just said I'm five foot four. You think? Okay, last time I okay, last time I like measured myself, I was five foot four. Okay. And how many centimeters is that? I'm trying to remember. It's one hundred. I think it's funny that you know feet before centimeters. Or something. Okay, it's almost no, like you well, get, like, don't even use the system that you have in place. We do, for, like everything else except for height. Because that's like the common thing to say. Hold up, I'm checking this out. I think it's 140 no, something. No, sorry, no. Mm -mm. No, I am. I am. Too late. Uh, yeah, I don't care foot, though. You don't use it as your main one, so it doesn't count. You guys do not use the metric system. I was incorrect. It's proof. 162 centimeters. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, was, proof, proof. I was close. I was like, I was less than a ruler off. Arsenal says that Morbid is four foot five. Oh, okay. I am not four foot five. I'll have you know, I'm only the shortest in my household by like a, like an inch. Wait, wait, you almost said centimeter. Well, centimeter inch, same thing. <laughs> uh no. No, an inch is. Like two, almost two and a half centimeters. Exactly. Yeah, even I know that. <laughs> Uno reverse, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that might be closer to a centimeter, actually, though. Like genuinely. You sure they're not two foot three? I, I don't know. I don't know. At what? Point, Why do we get shorter two. and shorter every time the sound tries to? You say one foot two. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Turning into Thumbelina at this point. What the heck? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. Hmm. What can we do? Oh yeah, we gotta figure out what. Okay, I gotta look at this mod. Let's look it up. Yep. yep. Two foot one. I'm not one Another inch tall. One. Yep. You. Come what? here. Wait, who's you? Not you. Okay. This person that I'm just gonna dump off the side. Ah! Alright, the I... Abyss 2 for 1.16.5, very good. The huge 2.0 update! The best dimension mod ever! You gotta say it like that, it just makes it more dramatic. Ow. Zero foot half. Oh boy. I'm being bullied. You're hitting me. I'm confused. Y'all are bullying me about my height. It's not nice. Never. I don't think you can be bullied about that. I mean, well, at that point. Here, I give you. I give you sandwiches to make you feel better. Yay! <laughs> eat, eat, eat them up. It'll help you grow tall. <laughs> Dude, the millimeters are like so tiny. Where did I just hear somebody tell a skeleton to eat a sandwich? Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. That was that was Jakey. No. Open up. 
think it was you, actually. Me? N no, no, uh, I mean, that was like weeks ago on uh, oh, yeah. with that, but no, someplace, someplace else. I'm not one millimeter tall! Wow, that would be impressive. That would actually be really impressive. <laughs> What three dimensions. It has it had three, but it says it has one. What's more than a millimeter? I can't remember. What's more than a millimeter? Centimeter smaller is more than, than a millimeter. Smaller no, than a centimeter. Smaller. Nanometer. Is it smaller than a... Um, meter? Picometer. Is it picometer. I mean, a millimeter is... Micro. Micrometer or nanometer? A micrometer? No. <laughs> A micrometer hey, is a measuring device for measuring really small things. I I have three words. I'm curious to see how you pronounce. Oh no. One atom tall. You have shrunk. Oh, that's a nasty looking um, spider. I think it's one atom twelve. How do you pronounce that, T? Well, it depends on which one you mean. <laughs> it, it, it's 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 one it's one word well yeah yeah i know that but i mean there are several places bearing that name in, in canada so i shouldn't pronounce it newfoundland or what it's pronounced newfoundland okay yes it's, it's <laughs> very <laughs> that's newfoundland come yeah, on that's what i that's what i was what? saying it depends on which <laughs> word you mean <laughs> In Canada, it's Newfoundland. And then there's that. But I think I spelled it wrong. Newfoundland. That's how Jay says. Newfoundland. How tall is Keithan? Uh, he looks to be about two meters tall. Just under. Yeah, exactly one point... Wait, what was it? Uh, I can't remember. Eight? Five? I think that's right. Wait. Wow, this looks really interesting and really deep. Magic, yeah. ring, spells. Okay, I'm sorry, Jackal. I apologize. I'm Newfoundland sure and you... Labrador. And, wait, did I you say mean like that? You mean Labrador. Labrador. <laughs> I did not know that. We're I was thinking about it now. <laughs> <laughs> when I learned about Newfoundland, it was just Newfoundland and Labrador was separate. Hey, when I used when I learned about it, it was it was, it was Czechoslovakia. And I was very proud to be able to spell that. Yeah, and then all of a sudden they're like, no, 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 no. we're Slovakia yeah, and uh, Czech <laughs> Republic. I'm like, no! Wasted skill. There's no such thing as Czech Your, your dad is a newt? And your mother yeah. smells of elderberry? What? It uh, says newt. I know. It's oh. funnier to misread it, though. <laughs> I am what not as tall as a cork. As oh my a goodness. Cork. Wait, hold up. Here, you mean you're shorter tall? than a cork? What? Six no. feet tall. I am not. In, oh, he, he, in, he, in game orbit. In game. Okay, we, we, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that was a. That was I'm liking this a this thing. Um, I'm. That's cool. Being an old old man, I'm shrinking. <laughs> you know. Sorry. <laughs> Abyss. Come on, search. The Abyss 2, the other side. Oh. You can get the Abyss beginning, which is an add-on. Well, you would want to begin at the beginning. Yeah, but it's an add-on. You Are you okay over there? No, don't hurt me. I can't run, hold Baby, up. Baby, don't hurt me. No more. <laughs> I feel like you're being quite rude. Oh, my shoes broke. Did you did you not just hit me multiple times over and over again? And I hit you three times, and you're like, eh, I'm being bullied. Now that was just uncalled for. You hit me once, I hit you once. That was it. I'm also shoeless. <laughs> Ah, bare feet! Horrible. Name not Joe, you can't be shoeless. 
to you. Are you gonna what? sleep or just dance around I my body? I was in bed. You y'all y'all were busy punching each other. Y'all, you ain't southern enough to say y'all. I say y'all, and I live like way up north. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize it was like a regional restriction. Uh, yeah. It's a <laughs> it's a it's a southern thing. Sorry, should I stop saying y'all? Am I yeah. am I being rude? You're offending you, Jay. Jay. <laughs> Although Jay is so far south that he it's become north again. That's a, that's the truth about Florida. <laughs> Until you get all the way down south, and then you're in a different country. Uh, okay. Florida's weird. Jay laughs. <laughs> I have never been that far into America. I'd like to You've go been to California. We all know. You said it like 20,000 times. I'm, I'm allowed to share my one experience out of my country. <laughs> I didn't realize. I'm sorry. I'm gonna, one of these days, I'm gonna like go to Florida and I'm just not gonna say anything. And nobody will know. Nobody will know <laughs> until it's no. like it's an argument and it's like this exact situation. It's like we already know you've been to California. No, I've been to Florida. No more will be on their deathbed and be like, by the way, I went to Florida. <laughs> <laughs> this will be a hill I will die on. Mm-hmm. Florida yeah. really isn't very hilly. No, it's not. Although the highest point in Wisconsin is named Tim's Hill. So Good for Tim. we're not exactly tall either. I don't know who this Tim person is either. Oh, bad for Tim? Y'all just need to stop saying y'all. I'm not I'm allowed to say y'all because I live half north and and south. What do you say, Morbin? What? What what? My what? brain stopped working. When did it start? <laughs> Fun fact, you live at the highest point in Florida? You, don't, you live on top of a skyscraper? You just don't live in Okefenokee, do you? And yes, that's a real word, Morbid. You're a real word. Thank you. You're welcome. Emotional damage. <laughs> <laughs> no, the highest point above sea level. Yeah, that would be a in in a. Isn't the highest point in Florida underwater? <laughs> That's funny. Morbidbrain.exe does not compute. Mm -hmm. it needs to be rebooted. Error with system. Do you wish to restart program? All right. Um, I honestly don't know what to do. Yeah, because we need like need to restart the entire server to get the mods downloaded. Mm -hmm. When we all need to download it, we all need to install it. I need to put it on the server. Oh yeah, did adding you another dimension that? now. Well, I like that abyss. I think that one sound pretty cool. Hopefully, your computer can handle it. Uh, I'll run it separately to make sure I can. If we decide on it. Or if we have that one like genuinely in the running, like we'll run that one off. On the oh, it's time. it's it's the runnings. It's the runs. Okay. So then after this, I'll quickly see if I can if it will run on my computer. <laughs> All right. Let's um. I've got it. Now I just need to find it. There it is. World Dimensions 2 mods. Where is it? The abyss? Oh. Yeah, there's probably under the. They do that sometimes. No. It might be one of the mods that aren't actually on there. No, no, I found it and I've got it downloaded. I'm just trying to figure out where it is in my. Um, Oh. My folder. Fine, I'll go by date modified. It's not in my folder. Apparently, I haven't run it yet, and it hasn't downloaded it completely. Okay. Fine. Leave that that sounds way. like a big mod, then. 
Um, it's only 57 megabytes. Oh, I don't know how big that is. Tiny. Oh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, well, at this point, I'll, I'll give myself a commercial plug. If you guys um, want to, you can check me out over on Twitch. Um, actually, you can check out Tenor right now, too. He's playing Wind Waker. That's me. Check me out. Give me a follow. I'd appreciate it. I'm really close to affiliate. Check out Tenro. He's uh, playing Wind Waker right now. I wish I was watching. Um, anyway, let's see here. I will be streaming there on Thursday night. Will you be joining Morbid? Um, maybe. Depends what time you're starting because I have my I have rehearsal that day mm. earlier. That'll be and starting at depends. eight, which is six for you. Should be good. It also depends on my homework, though. Yeah, well, get it done early. Uh, you know, I... be responsible. Okay, well, like, here's the thing. My <laughs> homework is writing an entire 15-page paper, okay? Ah, uh, lazy. Um. <laughs> Back in my I'm day, sorry. I'm we sorry. I... 15-page papers by hand. We I'm, had to I'm go just... get our own trees and whittle the sticks and burn the ends for charcoal to write word <laughs> i'm sorry skunk um I'm, I'm missing the point where i asked for your opinion on my homework uh jeez oh. i i gave it i don't care i gave it <laughs> it has been given <laughs> all right let's throw these oh. things in here what Hold up, game, game's freezing uh-oh we haven't even had the guy in yet. Oh. Question is, can I plant these? Yes. No, we can't. Oh well, not right there. You can't. No. Hmm. I might need to do a hard restart my computer pretty quick, though. Honestly. Yeah. Well, I'm not sure how much longer we're going to go because I don't know what to do. Yeah. Apparently, I didn't plan for this. It's kind of sad, actually. Kind of sad. Oh, I'm gonna make some more sandwiches, or at least get ready to make the sandwiches. Man, these sandwiches look disgusting. Blueberry, mulberry—that's fine. Carrot, baked potato. And do, 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 do. Bookie, bookie, book, book, bookie, book. I I book found a website book. I coded a while ago. You coded? Yeah. I, I, I had to get coding class in my uh school, I think in like grade eight. And I found the website that I made. Huh. Cool. It was horrible oh and, like it had working cool. tab like it had working tabs and like you can navigate through it properly like an actual like website with different pages but it just looked bad well i would send you over to the website that i created but it was for my brother and then you would you would know who i am yeah. not not you per se i don't really care if you but yeah those on the stream HTML isn't coding. Oh, don't you give me that, Z. You are 100% wrong there. If it, involves adding, that if it involves adding numbers or data into a computer to make it do stuff, it's coding. That is... And at least, um, like, I, I, I'm, touch, I'm not even scratching the surface of using, well, Scratch. Because that was a weird program. Now, technically, I used HTML plus, uh, uh, what is it, CSS and JavaScript, but, and yes, I know JavaScript is. No, HTML is not UI design. You have to put this code that is involved. 
I used HTML because I was like 13 and we. <laughs> you used to learn... Scratch to program drone flights? That... Well, actually, I think that's actually really cool. And Z says it Scratch isn't at all coding either. Oh, Goodness gracious. Okay. Z, okay, here's the thing when it comes to Scratch. Scratch is a beginner program for people who don't know what they're doing. <laughs> like my. I will I will die on that hill. It is a it is an introductory program. And I I oh, programmed lion. I actually programmed a whole music video in Scratch actually. A music video. Yeah, no, I programmed it to be an animated uh, an animation, but instead of like an actual animation, I programmed it so like, each layer would actually move across the screen, screen and it was like randomized. It was really cool. You think, Jackal, you don't know? You don't know? What kind of a father are you? I mean, I actually don't think my parents even know I took code again. I thought you were going to say exist. But... <laughs> 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 That's what it sounded like it was going for, yeah. Yep. <laughs> Honestly, my parents don't even know what it is. <laughs> okay, it, it's code. It's a, it's an introductory program to coding for people who don't fully understand that stuff. It, it is coding. <laughs> and you can switch off of it. Off of the drag and drop stuff. I used to do that because I, I thought I realized typing was way easier for me than the actual drag and drop. Personally, I kept losing like half the like half the things I needed. Okay, um, I have a problem with the way you're saying that. <laughs> what? Drag and drop. What? Drag and drop. What, what, how am I saying it weirdly? It sounds like something that a dragon poops. What? No, I'm. <laughs> <laughs> is this another Canadian moment? A Canadian accent moment? Like the sorry? And so what you see is what you get, Coder. I had a program that I used um, a long time that had similar things like that. Uh, was it... Was it Delphi? Yeah. Portland Delphi. Mm-hmm. Wow, that was a long time ago. It was a drag and drop, but it also had coding. It had yeah. dragons in it? It had dragons in it, too. <laughs> no, it didn't have dragons. It only had their droppings. Completely different thing. Right. Did it download it yet? That's not the button I wanted to hit. Fine, I'll put it in the other one. Tell me learn basics. You feel like, yeah, I'd hope you learn them wrong. <laughs> I feel like Z has some opinions on this. He has stuff. very strong opinions on coding. I mean, very, very strong. This is very true. Um, who am I looking for? You. Um. Nope. Uh... I know you're a professional developer by trade, but still. Just because everybody doesn't use the same language that you use doesn't mean they aren't programming! It's like, it's like saying that I, I make art professionally, so anyone who doesn't draw the way I do is incorrect. Yeah, they're not real artists. Yeah. If you haven't sold anything, you're not a real artist. I haven't sold anything, but I've had my art displayed in an actual gallery before. You lost your Xbox controller and a priest! Your teacher looked and sounded like Bert, Bill Murray. Maybe it was. In disguise. Who's Bill Murray? <sighs> <laughs> I can feel the disappointment through the call. 
<laughs> that is the sound of utter disappointment. Utter disappointment? No, utter. utter oh. Utter. utter. It's when there's no milk. How do you how do you not know Ghostbusters, Groundhog Day? Um I know Ghostbusters. I think I may have watched it as like a little kid. No, not the new one. No, not the new one. The old one. <laughs> I think it was like Chronic a Tony Retro or something. No, it is totally not the same as that, Z. It is not the same as that. That is different. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Ghostbusters, Ghostbusters 2. No, uh, no, I know. Space Jam. Yeah. Uh, I can't remember if I've seen the full movie of Space Jam, honestly. How do you not watch the full movie? You don't even know it. Did. My <laughs> parents, I, I never had any interest to watch it on my own because I kind of grew up hearing it was a bad movie. What? So I had no interest. I heard it was a bad movie. How dare you? How dare I you? I'm just, don't shoot the messenger. How dare your parents? <laughs> You've never seen Spam Jackal? You Canadians. I know, I know the song because it was a meme. But that's about, that's about my knowledge of it. How, what is wrong with you people? How do you not see all of the movie? <laughs> I told you my reason for I haven't seen a full movie of a lot of things. I think that's I think that's why I haven't seen the entirety of um of the Ghostbusters because that was another daycare thing. They went to show them the Ghostbusters at daycare. That's okay. So back in the day, that was the rated PG, but it shouldn't have been. Yeah. They didn't know how to rate things in the eighties and early nineties. Hmm. Hence the reason why there are PG movies with nudity in them from those from that decade. Hmm. Tenro, you haven't seen Space Jam either? Oh my goodness, <laughs> Tenro! Tenro! Tenro, how dare you not be streaming? I just sent everyone over to you. That was, it was too violent. And, you know. What, what's Rocky Space... and Bullwinkle? You haven't seen Rocky and Bullwinkle? No, I haven't. Uh, but, of course, I, I watched I, the Rico Moose. cartoon, but... Moose is kidding <laughs> <laughs> Rocky the squirrel and Bully with the moose and that's 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 like um that's like skunk's opinion on um, because I'm Canadian I've seen every Canadian film. <laughs> well, you you at least should have seen every Canadian or every film that has Hugh Jackman in it. I mean that's just a prerequisite of being Canadian. I the only thing I've seen with Hugh Jackman in it is The Greatest Showman. Never heard of it. It was a. You musical. haven't heard of that? <laughs> oh my goodness! What is this? I, I, I don't know that I haven't heard of it. It's a musical about the guy who made the first circus. And it was completely wrong, but it's it a is. movie. They tend to get things wrong. <laughs> Jack was Australian, um, not Canadian. Is he Australian? He's no, he's not. Is Why he? Is I thought he was Canadian. Is he could be. He is Australian. Huh. What do you know? Yeah, isn't like a total isn't like a stereotypical Australian name as well? Uh don't know many Australians to know that. Fair enough. You've heard of some of these? I feel like we need to have like movie nights here. This is. Dude, we need to have like a like a Zankar wide movie night. Apparently, but T's not on that. Oh no! Needs to watch uh, no. Too. I was gonna say Jim Carrey. Yeah, that does work. I was looking up. I didn't know that Michael J. Fox was Canadian though. You guys do have some really talented actors though. Ryan Reynolds. Uh... Oh, hey, Leslie Nielsen was Canadian. To, oh man. Are you ready to judge yeah, me again, Skunk? Oh, I never stop. 
Uh, Raymond Burr was Canadian. Oh. I've seen two movies that had Jim Carrey in it. That's about it. What? I I didn't like his other films. I they I didn't like them at all. I like I, those were movies I got like partway through, and it was just I did I hated it so much I stopped watching. Okay, he he is he does take a different flavor of movies. Um, let's just see if we can go through his filmography. So I, I, yeah, Ace, Ace Ventura, Ventura Cable Guy, Dumb and Dumber, Batman Forever, The Mask, Ace Ventura, Pet Detective. Seen all of those. Liar, liar. Um, me, myself, and Irene. How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Bruce Almighty. Lemony Snicket's a series of unfortunate events. Oh, he was in Horton here. So who? I wonder what voice he was in there. Wait, was he? Um, then, I, then I've seen three. Dumber and Dumber two. Wait, was he? Christmas Carol. Whoopsie! I never did. Never did see the Truman Show. I need to watch that one sometime. Wait, I'm looking up who Jim Carrey. <laughs> I'm looking up the cast of Horton. Hold up. Yep. Yeah, seen. A lot of his. I've seen. Well, now I've seen. Oh, Jim Carrey was Horton. Okay. Yeah. I did not huh. know that. So I've yeah. seen Horton Here's a Who, um, The Carly Grinch Show Christmas, and Sonic. <laughs> I never saw Sonic. It looked too bleh for me. Mm. Jim what, Carrey was the best thing in that show. Sonic? I believe that 100%. Oh, no. He, I, I loved his character personally. I know, Z. Like, I, where can I watch that, actually? I need to watch that one. I know you can watch it, because I watched it. <laughs> wow, that was that was deep there. Well, <laughs> it's not like I'm going to pay to see a movie. Isn't that how you watch movies, though? Like, <laughs> no, I pay for a service to watch a movie. But you're still paying for that movie, technically. Um, I'm paying for the service. And if, uh, is it Hulu? Oh, I hate Hulu. I... Time was bad. It wasn't great, but it wasn't bad, yeah. Yeah, Hulu is uh, all the Disney stuff that isn't Disney. <laughs> Basically, yeah. Um... No, 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 go away. Go away. I started playing oh, stuff. Something. You, th you think you've seen all those movies? I've seen most of them, I would say that. Or at least most of his good ones. Okay, what did I get here? Okay. Harold's um, Reinforced Steel Tunic. I personally really want to watch Doctor Who. I haven't seen it, but I've seen some clips from it. I'm kind of feeling the same way. Doctor like, Who? Really... Yeah, but I don't know where to watch it. Because I've oh. seen like a bunch of different versions of it. Yeah, do you start at the um, beginning or do no, you start at the beginning? You, you, of the start, season? you start with like eleven, the the new the new one. Do you and... work your way back or just stay here and keep going forward? And where do you watch it as a thing? I haven't BBC. Found uh but you get a you get a VPN and <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't even know if I'm able to watch it right now. I watched a lot of... Yeah, so you feel the same way about it. I watched a lot I... of them the recent, the, the, from the newer series. Ziz. Off topic, I can totally see Skunk having a podcast. I'm gonna be honest. Me? Yeah, totally. What are you talking about? I don't know, like... You can I, talk I can about you have... the, the, the... <laughs> the movies that my friends haven't seen. <laughs> so just like anything and everything. I think I think you would have a pretty cool podcast, honestly. Oh. <laughs> Start with Spirited Away. Spirited Away is so good. I love that one. That's a movie I enjoy. Have, have you seen Spirited Away, Skunk? Uh, I don't think so. Have you seen any um, Miyazaki movie? Or, I have I guess... no clue what word you just said. <laughs> okay, then go watch um, Princess Mononoke. Yeah, that's Silver Spirit movie. <laughs> okay. Skunk, one day I'm going or, to or uh, force you to watch um, Miyazaki <laughs> slash uh, Ghibli movie with me. Okay. Because they're really good and I love them so much. And my all-time favorite is Totoro. And for once, it's not like a super sad. 
No, that your one name. I mean, it's not like it's. What is uh, that? It's not like it's Grave of the Fireflies or something. You know. I haven't seen that one personally. Ah. I've seen I've, I, I've seen a lot of Miyazaki movies though. I just haven't seen all of them. Like I've seen Princess Mononoke, uh, Spirited Away. I've seen oh my gosh, what's it called? It, this not the way. It's the one with the wings and the technology. The the, the girl who oh my gosh, I know what I'm talking about. I sound see, like uh... I can describe it. Oh, I'm oh, going on um, Netflix. Uh, 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 it starts with. The... Um, Hold up, I'm, I'm opening Netflix so I can see if I've seen it, because I know it's on Netflix. Oh, wow, it's on Netflix in Canada? Dang. Yeah. That it's is why lot. you need a VPN. Yeah. Me. Hold up. Uh, and I'm seriously considering getting one. Because we... Canada gets all the stuff on Netflix that I want. Um. Okay. I've seen House Within Castle. I've seen the. I've started watching Kiki's Delivery Service. So I got really distracted. Spirited Away, uh, Whisper of the Heart, Princess Mononoke, uh, My Team Neighbor Totoro. I want to watch Castle in the Sky. Nausicaa Valley of the Wind. That's yeah, what I was that's talking the one. about. I knew there were some A's in there. Yeah, I've seen Nausicaa. Uh, I watched that one with the, at my friend's place for her birthday one year. Um, but yeah, no, uh, Miyazaki films are my favorite, like some of my favorite animated films, and I'm going to absolutely force you to watch them, Skunk. Uh huh. Because you want her to watch all your movies? Them. You should definitely. I have. Oh, sorry. You want so you many want, more on my list. You though. want them to watch your movies? You should watch their movie. Yeah, and you, and you, and, and they're you, one and you... movie for my 2,000 movies. <laughs> Look, okay, didn't you? Like... <laughs> think the one movie I've, you've seen that I recommended to you was decent? It was decent, yeah. I'm not saying I'm not going to watch the one that you recommended. Mm. It's just going to take me a much shorter time to watch the movies that you've seen that I haven't <laughs> than for you to see the ones that I've seen and you haven't. Okay. It's only on HBO Max. Oh, man. Truman what, Show. The, uh, Truman Show? Yeah. Mm. What is the Truman Show, by the way? The Truman Show is... Um, it, uh, it's a movie about a guy who is part of a TV show and he didn't know he was a part of a TV show. Basically, it's about his life. Yo, cool. And he doesn't know that he's even. He doesn't know that he's really on cool. a reality show. Yeah. Oh, no, you can't. Yeah, yeah, I've heard of that one. That one actually is interesting. I do kind of want to watch that one as well. So I don't my, know uh, significantly short amount of time, Jackal. Uh, half. Half is long. So um, should have seen at least half the movies that I've seen. Sorry. <laughs> Do a watch party on your Discord? I don't have time. I watch, I watch movies when I have time because I'm doing other things. Like last night, I was working on Zankar, and so I was watching The Eternals. I really, I kind of want to watch Eternals, but I'm not like a huge Marvel person, so I, I haven't seen anything else. So I'm not going to understand anything in it. No, they matter, Jackal. Don't you give me that. Those matter a lot. How woo! <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Attempt that one, Morbid. What? Sorry? No, correctly. Sorry. Oh no, that's Canadian. No, it's not Canadian. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, I'm saying I'm saying how it is. Sorry. No, no, you've got an <laughs> accent you don't even realize. <laughs> how do you say it? Wait. No, you no, you say it's so like you copy it, like genuinely. I can't right now because it, it, I've got it, it's under pressure. You can't say it naturally if you're under pressure. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to be natural. I, just I don't know what you're that. talking about. So. The word sorry. Sorry? Yeah. Soiree? You don't hear it either, Jackal? Yeah, no, because we're both Canadian. Americans don't have a way of sorry? saying that word. Yeah, it's kind of like saying starry without the T. 
That's not even how it's spelled, though. It's pronounced. It's spelled sorry. <laughs> Since when do we say things the way that they're spelled? Fair enough. <laughs> I I will back you up on that one because of mosquitoes. I mean mosquitoes. Yeah. Uh, Americans ca just can't say sorry. That's true. We're very bad at saying it, and, and Canadians way that more than make up for it. <laughs> more is like. Oh, I'll be like, mm, are you going to make it out on Thursday? Mm, no, I've got this family thing. I'm really sorry about it. And I'm like, why are you sorry about that? Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm like, no, it's it's life. It happens. Don't be apologetic. Oh, I'm sorry. No, don't say you're sorry anymore. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's literally how like half of our conversations go. <laughs> I can't even deny it. <laughs> yeah, enough. Cough. Tough. Through. What's really I fun is... You know, context of getting read and read correctly. I've I've seen someone rhyme all those words together. It was like really interesting. No, they they I, don't rhyme. That's the point. No, but someone like, actually made it sound poetic. It was really cool. Huh. Um. This one. Um. This one. Um. Oh, and then I, yeah, I just started watching um, uh, Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings today because I got home early, sick from work. So, oh. not my fault. I did not make you sick. <laughs> you gave me an internet virus. Shame on you, T. <laughs> no. Um, kind of on the, like, kind of going back a topic to uh, old movies. Um, recently I've really. Wait, how old is old? You watched Citizen it in the first Kane. ten years of your life. Oh, of my life. Then. Okay. Uh, in I've seen general, black and white movies. So. Uh, in in my life, the first within the, like when I was like really little, I'm thinking of as old movies. So we're I talking know about the 2020s. Dude, I'm talking like <laughs> 2000s. Because I think this we can like two like early 2000s. Um, and I wanted to watch it. It's called Stella Luna. And it was the story of a fruit bat who lost, who felt, who got separated from her mom, and was raised by birds. Oh my! And it's super, it's a, it was like my favorite movie when I was a little kid, and I was like start with like my love of bats because I, I actually really like bats, honestly. Like, not even fitting with the whole like ooh morbid bats are spooky kind of thing. It's like I genuinely love bats; they're adorable. Why would you hit me? That was genuinely unprovoked. Okay, now say this word. Okay, say that word, Morbid. What word? Caribbean? See, that's the thing is, if you say the Pirates of the Caribbean, you don't say Pirates of the Caribbean. It's Pirates of the Caribbean. But it's the Car... It's the... Ca now, ah, no! Okay, that I'm was a book sorry. First. So what was the book first? Still oh, probably the one that you were saying, yeah. Yeah, I, I haven't, I never, like, okay, here's the thing. I had, like, one of those, like, little kid, di like, discs where they have the handle on the top and, like, 50 different things in the disc. Like, I think there was, like, a craft and there was, like, a whole, like, seminar about, like, bats and m myths of bats. Oh, there was, like, a whole gotcha. song. Gotcha, gotcha. You never start I mean, a movie if you can't finish it in one sitting? Oh. Yeah, I, I always do that. I, it as I never can. start a movie if I can't finish it in one sitting, and then I don't finish it because I fall asleep on it. <laughs> <laughs> That's because Disney has programmed the pronunciation into all of our minds. No, 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 no. Pirates of the Caribbean was a thing. I mean, it was Disney World's attraction thing. Um, but the Caribbean, that's definitely been something for a long yes. time. Yes, yes. Because in school... Oh, no! What? To the stream. In You're streaming school, right now. Back That's amazing. In the 2020, 2020, 2020. That's in a lot of school. 20. Way back in like uh, 1932 or whenever it was. So back when you were in high school, gotcha. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> back when I was in um, <laughs> elementary, we were taught that there were two pronunciations of it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah uh, have you watched other pirate movies by disney welcome to the stream by the way enigmatic um well i've watched um off oh, say treasure island <gasps> which one and i watched treasure planet 
I love Treasure but, Planet. That was like but, my favorite movie for a long time. Well, 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 Treasure Planet is Treasure Island in space, but which Treasure space. Island? I've never seen Treasure Island, but I've seen Treasure Planet and Treasure Planet. The was, the, like, the movie. old Treasure Island. Thanks, Z. Peter Pan. That's true. I've seen that one as well. The old Treasure Island, which created the pirate uh, accent, Genre. whatever. Oh, the pirate accent, yeah. Um, I've watched... Oh, Shipwreck. That was a good movie. Mm, I like that one a lot. Um, I, yeah, it's all oh, yeah, I was... for the Pirates of the Caribbean movies. Swiss Family Robinson. That had pirates in it. All right, see you, Uno. Have fun with your stream. Uh, I watched a lot of Disney movies. Way before Disney Plus came out. Hmm, need to watch Treasure Planet. I watched a review on it, and now I need to watch. It was decent. It was decent. I liked it. I mean, it. it's just a retelling of the original tell. Um, I didn't know Treasure Island was a thing, so I looked at it. It was like, yeah. it's a movie, a movie on its own, so I really liked it. Yeah. Um, I read the book. Then I watched the movie. Then I watched the other movie. Okay. Until I forget the details. Does somebody yeah. know how to make a uh, cow breedy thing? Nope. Um, depends. Let's see what other ones. Davy Crockett and the River Pirates. I don't know if I ever actually watched that one. I don't think I would ever bother watching that one. I don't think I would either. I mean, maybe Davy Crockett, but not Davy Crockett. Oh, yeah. And... I watched Davy Crockett back in the day, but, and the Pirate, the River Pirates, yeah. Oh, you need to forget the plot a... twist, yeah. I have a question. The plot twist in Treasure Planet was slightly different. What was that? What's Davy Crockett? Okay, I'm going to forgive you for that one because that's an American thing. And it's also quite old. It is quite old, but if you were from America, I would hope that you would have learned Davey. it at least one time. Yeah. Davy Crockett. Um, <laughs> wild frontier. He was a pioneer in early American history. Uh, he did a lot of trailblazing and uh, a lot of uh, scouting and exploring, that sort of thing. Um, mm -hmm. And he... I do believe he died at the Alamo. Hmm. Do you know what the Alamo is? No. Oh, okay. Kind of figured by your... Hmm. Yep. Fought at the Alamo. Died at the Alamo. Hey, Jackal got it. He's from Canada. Nice. Guy with a raccoon on his head. Very good, Jackal. Yes. Coonskin <laughs> hat. That's what he was known for. Um, okay, so the Alamo was... Um, a fort in <laughs> Texas, I believe. Um, and it was being held by a very small of soldiers, American soldiers. And they were going up a against a very large... Why are there fences here now? A very large force, uh, I believe Santa Ana's men um, army. And they held out for a very long time. Uh, but in the end, they were all killed in the battle. Um, and it became a bad guy for the United States in, um, in the war. Um, remember the Alamo. Oh. So. And how brave the men that were that fought there and how, you know, we need to fight for their cause. What war was that, Jackal? Do you remember? Uh, Jackal, wow. Tiefen? <laughs> oh, I was waiting for Jackal to answer. Yeah, I don't know if Jackal remembers. Spanish-American War? Okay, that's what I thought it was. Wow, you know our history, Jackal. I'm impressed. I know like absolutely nothing about yours. Wow, that's rude. <laughs> well, I mean, it's Canadian. I mean, way up north. I mean, not as north. Well, I mean, it is as north as Alaska, but nobody cares about that part of it. Alaska's more north than like a huge chunk of Canada. Well, yeah, but so, yeah, not but also more north than the Northwest huge Territory. Chunk of Canada is further exactly. north than Alaska. Yeah, so I think like, you're right. Jekyll. Happy middle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Alaska's like the warmer part of Canada. 
<laughs> um, it was during Texas's war for independence from Mexico. Interesting. <laughs> All I know is that Canada burned down our White, our White House one. Oh, ours got burned down. Y yeah, we don't have a White House. Oh. We have a uh, no. We have a, 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 a believe a par building a parliament. Yeah, makes sense. Um, I could be incorrect on that one though. I just know the um the BC building is known as the Parliament Building, and that's like the yep. most intense name it is. Canadian history: War of 1812, and we burned down the White House. The end. Yeah. <laughs> Enigmatic says I have very little knowledge of the wars. Well, see, that's the problem: is that. Well, yeah, things that lead to wars are very important. Am I, am things I that happen the during the wars, not quite as much. You know, diff different nut you left. Yeah. Uh, different battles during wars aren't as, you know, important. You know, Normandy is important. Don't forget about Normandy. That was a very important thing. Um. um. Oh, sorry. Oh, she doesn't know what Normandy is. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think it's about World War II. No, we went all about that, like, May. the whole D Day situation. <laughs> and Eddie had a part in it. Yeah. Yes, yes. There, there was. Uh, the D Day landings. That's. Uh, we covered it, I believe, in grade 10. Yeah. Um. I still think it's interesting how different countries from around the world uh, ah. talk about the history of the world wars. Now I'm up in the air. Everyone usually wants to tell it from the best, uh, the best look from their own perspective. Except the Germans. Except for the Germans <laughs> who just try and pretend it didn't exist. <laughs> Don't ever bring it up. <laughs> yeah. Which one, Jackal? One or two? Being a Commonwealth country kind of meant we had to. Yeah, you kind of went into it as soon as uh, the mother country went in. Um, I, I don't remember where I heard from. I heard this really funny comparison between um, America's independence and Canada's independence. Yes, I think you how talked got it. about that. I may have. Yeah. It's like America it was, was like teen rebellion stage and uh, screaming and yelling and mm. fighting. Uh, where Canada brought it up over breakfast. <laughs> mm hmm And technically... I have not an medic. Te technically, the Queen is, uh, along, along with the UK, is Queen of Canada, but yeah. no, one, like, really, no one cares. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Respectfully. No, no one, no one like, pays yeah. attention. I have not heard of that. Queen is on your money. That means That's... you're not independent. <laughs> <laughs> we can make our own laws and you, stuff. I can say, do you send money to them frequently? <laughs> if yes, then you're not independent. If no, then yes. Wait. That sounds interesting, Enigmatic. I'll just see there's a movie about that. <laughs> the Alligator, welcome to the stream. We're kind of just talking about movies and world history because our we, we finished our dimension and we aren't adding another one until next week. So, Spanish double agent that worked for the Allies. Sound um, warning. Do you think I'm going to be loud? Did, was I loud? Did I did I make you want to come to the stream and see why I was being so loud? <laughs> uh, I remember for Remembrance Day, um, in at least in my school. We, uh, if this is, I know for a fact this is in grade 10. Uh, we had our assembly and we came back to our class, and the entire room was very solemn, um, because it was a very serious event. And our teacher was very adamant that we learned about the actual history and how bad things were. And because at the beginning of the year, he'd sent home a paper that said we'd be watching some things that were disturbing, he showed us the beginning scene of Saving Private Ryan. Mm. Oh. And that. Um, so that was a very harsh awakening, but I also remember I have never seen that teacher get mad except for once, and it was that day 
when there was, I think, two boys in the back of the class who were laughing and joking the entire time. Yeah, I can... so, well, that, that, that's gonna happen. He made it very clear, though, about the expectations, because mm -hmm. I don't know about in the States, but here in Canada, Remembrance Day is a very solemn day. Like, if there, when there's these ceremonies, no one claps or cheers or anything. Uh, you're expected to be dead quiet. It's, it, again, it's a very solemn day. Mm -hmm. um, and this was, I believe, the day before Remembrance Day, because we actually don't go to school that on mm -hmm. Remembrance Day. Dang. And there's normally different towns and cities have their big ceremonies and stuff at community centers. And I don't I don't know if it's much different in Alberta, Jack, so correct me if I'm wrong. Um but it was the expectations are very clear of you will be respectful and you will be quiet and you will acknowledge the, like what we're talking about and be respectful of the content because this is a very serious topic and I've never seen two people get sent out of the room faster. <laughs> wow. I wish our country was more like that. Jack says no pretty much the same. Mm -hmm. Um, I have friends and stuff who are in cadets and stuff and when it comes to the ceremonies here in Canada normally before COVID obviously now it's not so much a thing it's not as big at least here with all the precautions and stuff though there are still some ceremonies um, it's like you'd have the Highland drummers, Highland dancers any form of program that has any sort of relation to uh the country and historically like scott oh scotland or any of that stuff and you they take part in the ceremonies and it's usually a very be a very beautiful ceremony and stuff that happens why would you shoot me as we're talking about serious topics <laughs> He's that was one of those two kids <laughs> it's still it's still a video game <laughs> It was it was hard to hit you. You were running and jumping, yeah. and you don't um, seem to have issues with it. No, I'm, at, I'm. Hey, I I killed Silver. I'm pretty good at this whole PvP thing. Um, oh my gosh! The spy who hilariously won World War II. That sounds interesting. I will say this. I think in our schools, it's not as. I mean, people, we like for the kids to be more somber about everything but you know that ain't gonna people, happen but once you get into the military and anything that has to do with the military it is a very very serious thing um Robert have you ever heard of the tomb of the unknown uh, unnamed unknown soldier unknown yes uh, have you heard what goes into the people uh, the the soldiers that guard for that uh, I don't know about the U.S. If you guys have a different one than we do, but I know Canada has its own, and I know how. Oh, does it? Yeah. Yeah. Like the 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 soldiers who guard the tomb, uh, they have to go into training. They have to be a certain between a certain height, um, within like a couple inches. They it is considered one of the highest uh, honors that can be bestowed upon them. They are never, uh, it is never unguarded. Like there was a hurricane that went through the Washington DC area and the, the government told them that you guys do not need to be here, go home, you know, get somewhere safe. And they respectfully oh, no. declined and they said, we are going to guard the tomb. And so through the hurricane, they made their rounds. And so it's very very serious you know arlington seminary seminary wow arlington <laughs> cemetery where you know there's so many soldiers are buried it's a very serious place but so once you're in the military and around the military it's a very serious thing but unfortunately yeah a lot of younger people especially don't really care about it as much yeah i at the very least i grew up in a family where i was always taught that it's important to have that to the point where mm -hmm. Uh, when I was working in fast food, like, because it's, uh, f usually food places don't close during Remembrance Day, mm. uh, whereas a lot of things like social work or schools and all that uh, do close. Um, the, um, I remember actively putting in a paper that said I didn't, I couldn't, I couldn't work that day because I had always been raised so that is a day that you right. specifically cut out for that. 
Mm-hmm. So it's just like I, that. That's one day I don't ever want to work because it's very good. important to me to attend the ceremonies. It's important for me to. Mhm. It's good. So. But that's just how my family taught. I know that uh, my dad works in the school school system as well for the younger grades, and I know mm-hmm. that respect is sadly dying out in yeah. some generations and it's heartbreaking to hear yeah yeah this got to a very serious topic i apologize yeah. <laughs> no no it's not your fault no well no anyway the, the government you know doesn't want anything to be taught that pays them in a bad light but you gotta be respectful of the people that have served and died and are willing to serve and die for your country, which is why mm-hmm. I'm very thankful and respectful of Tiffin mm-hmm. and Gat Kong because they both served in our military. I did not know that. I no. think I, I did. Made- <laughs> I didn't know it either until I built uh, on the on the um, the Gat server. I built a memorial um, for Memorial Day, and they're both like, "Oh yeah, you served." I'm like, "Oh." Oh, thank you so much. I didn't even realize. I remember there used to be a veteran from World War II who used to come into my elementary school's breakfast club uh, and read to all of us. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. And there's like, and there's like a few veterans and stuff who used to come and volunteer at my school. Um, and outside of my the theater in my uh, current school, or my high school, there's a plaque that has all of the soldiers in, mm. I believe, World War II that came from our town. Yeah, we've got one in our town outside of our um, civic center. Mm-hmm. It was very specifically the students that, gra- that came from our high school. Yep. Yep. Um, but it's, yeah. <laughs> That's, that's interesting. Yep, yep, yep. This has just turned into a podcast, let's be honest. Yeah. <laughs> we can move on to something more lighthearted and enigmatic. But I think we're going to be done streaming pretty soon because we're just running around in circles at this point. We're just chatting. I can't even feed two cows. Uh, oh, no. Oh, well. But uh, yes, yeah, stay tuned. Next week, we're going to be adding in The Abyss 2, which seems to have quite a bit of content. I like to see the advancement tree. That's going to be interesting. Watch Magic again, there's no advancement. Yeah, it's like, one, you did it. Yay! <laughs> um, uh, again, I, I don't mind running cookie testing it and stuff. Like yeah. Either tonight or tomorrow. Okay, yep. No, we've we finished all the dimensions that we have enigmatic. We finished the Gaia dimension earlier. Um, the only one that we haven't finished is the this one right here, um, the world of dimen- or the world of dimensional dungeons. But uh, it's it's a grindy thing, which isn't fun at all. Yeah, we're all the other pretty much done with it. <laughs> yeah, the other dimensions had some grindy things, but not like that one. Yeah, that one is purely. That's like that. Every time you go into it, like the achievements are purely based off of like a gamble, pretty much. Which project, Jekyll? Twilight Forest, an unfinished mod. Um, I don't know. Are any mods technically finished? I feel like they all just keep getting worked on little by little. The name's familiar. Who's who's Steven Spielberg? Like it's familiar. Like I'll probably he's know. He's a director. It. What did he direct? Steven a Brian lot Brian? of different movies. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, <laughs> I haven't seen the full movie of Steven Private Ryan. I've just seen um, the let's intro. see. I'll look at his filmography. He's got a lot, a lot of big yeah. ones. Um because he sounds very familiar. E. T. <sighs> oh, okay, I've seen some of his work. <laughs> um Minority Report, that was a good one. Same Private Ryan, he did. Um, mm-hmm. Jurassic Park, Schindler's List, Indiana Jones. Um, <laughs> you haven't seen Indiana Jones? No. Raiders of the Lost Ark? Nope. Oh. 
I've seen Jurassic Park once in, uh, because it happened to be in my local movie theater. And I went Please tell me time. Jaws. Uh, oh wow! Oh wow! Oh, that's wow. another half movie. Wow. Um, I'm not seeing that one here, Jekyll. Um. Oh, James Cameron. Gotcha. Oh yeah. Um. So the there's only been. I think like two movies that I or like one movie that I've generally gotten so bored if I fell asleep during and like got up and left for it. like purely do a base of boredom, and that was the tw- Transformers: The Last Night, <laughs> and because uh, that was yeah, the- Transformer ones really went downhill. Oh yeah, no, I loved the first one because I'm a Transformers person. I love Transformers a lot, um, and I. Went to go watch it with my family, and it was so bad. I left for like about an, I think two hours in because like a three four hour movie. See, animatic. I'm sorry, <laughs> but thing to go watch the Tintin movie is like telling me to go stick toothpicks under my fingernails. <laughs> um, respectfully, that, that's a strong opinion. I have read the Tintin comics. Uh, I own a number of the books, and they are very well done. They are great stories, and the movie just did not live up to my expectations in the slightest. Ooh. It's kind of like um, trying to say go watch uh, Mr. Popper's Penguins. You can go in the garbage okay. and leave it there forever. Hey, skunk. Yeah. What's Mr. Popper's Penguins? Okay, so Mr. Popper's Penguins was a book that I read multiple times as a kid. I love the book. Um, it's about this guy who um, he loves the exploration of the uh, Antarctic. He loves the penguins and knowing everything about the explorers down there. And he ends up getting a, a crate in the mail. And it has a penguin in it. And... Uh, He's very happy about his penguin and everything. The penguin starts building a nest and then gets very sad because it doesn't have a mate. Um, he ends up getting a mate for it and then it ends up having, they end up having eggs, raising other ones. And he develops a whole act that they, um, uh, they, they, the penguins perform and they're, um, it's a very fun story and one that i really really enjoyed um because you know as a a kid you you have dreams of like maybe owning some sort of an exotic animal and just see you know this book about him owning a penguin was kind of cool what do you mean wait what no keep going i'm I'm just trying to figure out where my water went oh i thought you were trying to figure out if you ever wanted an exotic animal (laughs) um and you know there's funny things that happen in the uh, in the book. Well, then I watched the movie because I love the book so much and it did not follow the book at all. There was there was so much in it that was not in the book and it was oh, it was just sickening to me. I see. You do decent fan attention even though I don't have the comics. I can say it, was, it is great. I watched the movie Enigmatic because I love the comics. And I've read so many of the books. I think there's probably about a dozen books, and I've read like 10 or 11 of them. Um, and I own about five of them. Um, they tried to cram multiple stories into one movie, and it just it just didn't make sense. It didn't follow. The, it, it just didn't like it, no. Um, um oops, sorry. But I, I hate when you've read the book and then you watch the movie and it just doesn't live up to your expectations. I would much rather watch the movie and then read the book and be like, oh, wow, that's way better. Mm -hmm. (laughs) That's what I did with Harry Potter. I watched the movies first. I'm like, oh, this is kind of an interesting story. And then I read the books and I'm like, these are way, way, way better. Hmm. You know nothing about Tintin? You saw the movie and it wasn't fan? Yeah, I kind of feel like it was a a very, um, a very niche market that would like that 
Um, one movie about a book that I've seen that I personally think was done pretty well was The Host by Stephanie Meyer. Um, uh, same author, author of Twilight, and I acknowledge that. I'm not a fan of Twilight. Tried reading the books, tried watching the movies, not a fan. And, um, but The Host is, like, a totally different premise of <laughs> there's these small aliens that come to Earth that uh don't fight don't like it's very very peaceful mm -hmm. but they get in order to survive they planted into people oh that's and they horrible. take over their consciousness oh that's horrible. so it's such, yeah no it does it's, not it's, sound peaceful it does not sound peaceful but like they're very <laughs> much the thing of like oh if you ask for something like there's no reason for me to like not give like give it to you like you need you need to use my car that i'm currently driving go for it um, but it's like the story follows this one person who I cannot remember the name of. I haven't read the book in a while. Um, but she gets the uh, implant with I believe the alien's name was Wanderer, and it kind of follows how Wanderer can still hear the voice of the main character, and it, there's constant conversations going between them. Where to the point where it actually slips that the main character knows where there are the pe that the humans who haven't been um, haven't had this implant are hiding. Assimilated. And, assimilated. Yeah. <laughs> um, but it's like this, and then by accident, Wanderer learns where the um, humans are and goes there, and it's this this really well written interaction between of like this conflict between Wanderer and the main character and the people around them and the relationships that these people already had with the main character but are also now developing with Wanderer and how only one of them can live when the other one can't. And only one of them can be in control. Uh, but the movie does really good with getting that internal dialogue um, and kind of writing it. And the scenery is also really good. And I recommend both, personally. Here's a fun fact that I didn't know. Uh, Stephanie Meyer is the author of The Twilight. Um, no, no, she, she was inspired by a dream. <laughs> yeah. And wrote Twilight in three months. Tw and yeah, but it's also a self insert. <laughs> uh, Little Brown and Company offered her $750,000. The most the company had ever offered for a first-time author for the manuscript and two feature books. So, oh, wow. wow. Yeah, and uh, another thing about Twilight is that uh, Bella Swan is a self-insert of Stephanie Meyer. I believe that. The only thing I need to know about Twilight... Is it Fifty Shades of Grey is Twilight fanfic? <laughs> I, I, I think that it, this would be a good thing to say that I don't know what I never watched that movie. Oh um, no, I've never had it. Uh, never that, will. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, but yeah, ed enigmatic. I act I per I personally do recommend reading the book. It's it's really good in my opinion. But I'm also a bit of a sci-fi nerd at some point, at some time, so. Um. Yeah, Jack, whichever comes first is usually the better version. I'm, I am almost, I'm getting to the point where I shouldn't be surprised, but, um, how many movies are produced today that are based on books that I had no idea were books? And then I watched the movie. I'm like, yeah, that was a pretty good movie. And then the people who are fans of the book are like, that was a bad movie. It was horribly done. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. I think that can kind of be seen in the series Shadowhunters on Netflix. Um, I don't know if you've seen it, Skunker T, or anyone mm, in your chat. It's has. on my list. I haven't. It, that is based off a book series uh, called The Mortal <laughs> Instruments. It was the first full novel series I read, and each book is about, I want to say, close to 600 pages. 
Mm-hmm. And I read the first book within a month. So. Mm-hmm. Um, but I got really into that series doing? and stuff. But I really enjoyed that one. But this, but in my opinion, from what I've seen of the first, of the, at least the first season from Shadowhunters, is it's actually, like, fairly book accurate. And they did, like, really well with it. And considering all of the, like, supernatural elements in it, they did, they did really well. They said, I also really like the series because vampires aren't romanticized in it. Aren't? They are not. Ah. Um, technically, they're not romanticized. There's one character that had a really, like, I think was bordering on a relationship with one of the main characters that was a vampire. But that one, like, he wasn't always a vampire. And it's not really a spoiler because that happens in, like, the first few chapters of the first book. Throw that in what? there. Throw that in there. Really, really, really good uh, book series and um, mo- and, t- and TV series. Though I watched all the TV series, so that's true. You have a good point there, Z. It's sad, but true. That that's all. Yeah, that's fair. So it's um, that's that's like. Uh... Metallica, right? <laughs> what? what? No? Okay. Is, Wait, what? Is what? It? Is. What's like Metallica? T? T? I don't know. Something is sad but true? I, I don't know. Didn't Metallica write a song about a soldier who got their older limbs blown off? That sounds horrible. Oh, it's a really sad song. And it, the music video was worse. So, uh, I just made that link because of what T mentioned. Uh, mm-hmm. or, and I, I don't mean to be in bed. I'm, I'm gonna tell you things. I'm in bed. All right, well, I'm going to wrap up my stream. I will talk to the both of you later. Oh, okay. Bye. Bye. We're done then. Well, you can stay on. Nobody's going to stop you. Nah, I don't really have anything to do. At least not yeah. until I figure out how to make cows properly. <laughs> that sounds bad. <laughs> Bye. Wait. Bye. But, but places... Fair enough. Bye.